What's up everyone? This is Muhammad and as I promised you guys in the last video, I'm gonna show you the gym in the apartment complex and I'll walk you through my workout. This uh, video is gonna be commentary, so uh, let's see. Um, first off, I'm gonna tell you this gym has limited equipment and I'm gonna do the best I can with what I have. So uh, as I said, we're doing uh, chest and triceps workout today. I started off the Smith machine with inclined chest presses. I gradually went up with the weight because the weights feel different from back home. And then I jumped onto the cable flies. You might feel I'm a bit off balance, the cable flies, but the reason is because these cables are not well calibrated. I did four sets of chest presses with 8 to 12 reps and supersetted that with cable flies 8 to 15 reps. So the next exercise is going to be cable flies on the inclined bench. Special announcement, I'm going to be working on my personal trainer certification in the United States in the next couple of months and when I get that I'm going to be launching my website www.alphaslice.org Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter for updates and some cool stuff and please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel because in the future this will help me a lot to spread my brand. So now I'll superset the inclined cable flies with inclined dumbbell presses. You might notice that I'm only using the 50 pound dumbbells in this exercise but the reason is these are the heaviest dumbbells in the gym. So I'm doing the uh, presses and then turning the dumbbells inward to face each other to make more stress on the inner packs and that will make the exercise a bit harder. I did four sets of each exercise with eight to 12 reps. If you guys are wondering, the gloves I'm wearing are from Shape. I'll review them in a separate video later on. Always, and I can't stress that enough, always make sure when you're pulling the dumbbells off the floor, pull them in a good form, in a safe manner, to protect your back. Because you know, these back injuries limit your weight you're gonna lift and hinder your progress and your gains. Make sure to train safely, continue making progress, be consistent, build muscle, and get to whatever goals you wanna get to. This next exercise, as you see, is the chest presses on the machine. I did four sets of that, eight to 12 reps, and then I superseted that with push-ups on the medicine ball, alternating hands with the medicine ball. And let me tell you guys, this exercise is freaking hard. With the push-ups, I kept going until I felt complete failure. Well, you might feel it this first time I recorded in the gym, so some people going around looking at me like, who's this guy? But don't worry, I'm gonna keep making these workout videos, no matter how weird it's gonna feel, but I know later it's gonna feel natural. Actually, this machine is for your abdominal muscle workout, but I'm gonna do triceps, overhead extensions, and this exercise works your lateral head of the triceps, so I did 4 sets, 8 to 12 reps each, and I went to failure on every single set. And then I jumped to the second exercise on the straight bar cable triceps extensions. I did 4 sets, 8 to 12 reps each. And it's very important on these exercises to keep your back arched. So you see my lower back is arched just to protect my back and do a good form to engage the triceps. And directly I supersetted that with the reverse cable triceps extensions and that engaged the inner head of the triceps. With this exercise, you're gonna lean forward on the dumbbell rack or any surface you like. And you don't need to use a huge amount of weight on this exercise. To do these triceps extensions, I used only 20 pounds. 
and you can fully engage the tricep muscle with that amount of weight. I did four sets, eight to 12 reps each, and of course, alternating hands. I always like to keep this exercise to the end because usually by this time, your muscle is fatigued and this exercise doesn't need a huge amount of weight and huge amount of energy. In doing this exercise, just make sure that your form is right, keep your elbow fixed, and just move your hand and your forearm to engage your triceps. And that was it, guys. Chest and triceps workout in a complex apartment gym with limited equipment. And I always encourage after your workout, do 15 to 20 minutes of cardio. So in my case, I'm doing 20 minutes of cardio on the treadmill. And that's it for now. Don't forget, like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel and enjoy the music. Now